This is a very special program uh, for uh, Haruo Shimada's channel. Uh, this is the first attempt to speak in English. Uh, I, I invited uh, uh, excellent uh, young person uh, whose name is uh, 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 Eddie Dan. Uh, in, in Japanese way, Dan uh, Eddie. But uh, l l let me call you uh, Eddie anyway. Uh, Eddie uh, is an excellent uh, young person. Uh, he was born as a child of uh, uh, Chinese uh, parents uh, who are doing a very important job to promote uh, Japan-China uh, mutual understanding. Yes. And uh, Eddie uh, joined an uh, uh, excellent high school called Ikubunkan and taking advantage of the opportunity of that uh, school, uh, he, he spent some time in New Zealand and had a uh, very important uh, inspiration there. Yes. And uh, he had, the Ikebunkan's philosophy is that uh, students have to have a big dream and have to work very hard to realize the dream, yes. uh, the uh, reality. Yeah. And uh, Eddie did a very hard work to do it. And uh, he is now preparing to go to uh, George Washington University, uh, uh, acquiring a, a very lavish uh, scholarship. And uh, his uh, target is to study um, a, a media literacy. Yes. Uh, the reason why he's interested in media literacy is that the current world is a, uh, uh, one might call a huge transition of information technology. Uh, internet is developing and people are using SNS and mass media is kind of uh, uh, getting sort of declining but uh, new media is improving. However, uh, even though technology and new media has emerged, uh, people's understanding of their reality or the truth uh, or uh, their judgment as to which is true, which is wrong, is getting somewhat deteriorating. Uh, this is a, a, a kind of contradictory uh -huh. uh, tragedy. And uh, I think Eddie's attempt is trying to uh, uh, fill the gap uh, in, in, in this highly uh, developed information society, uh, try to uh, develop a methodology by which people can uh, de develop their ability uh, of um, uh, uh, judging information, the quality of the information, the truth or problem of information. It's a very, very important yes, challenge. Yes. So now the floor is yours. Okay. Uh, tell, tell us what you're going to do. Okay, what I want to do is like, um, just exactly Mr. Hado say, uh, Mr. Shimada say, um, to develop media literacy for all the people in the world. And this is very big challenge, I think. It has no um, ends, like, it, it has many processes to it. And in university, what I want to study is like, the methodology to how to improve um, people's media literacy. But also, um, I want to develop a um, good media platform for um, delivering good information, like rich sourced uh, facts, and so those are my um, dream and goals, and what I want to study in university. The capacity or ability of people to understand yeah. the information relates to the amount of education. I think. Yes, it is. Uh, but uh, irony is that. In the highly motivated, highly developed information society like it is now, even though you have attended mm. or graduated from high school education or university education, people's capacity to understand information seems to be go, get, getting lower. Mm. Sure. Isn't, that, isn't that the irony, don't you think? Yeah, it is. Um, not only uh, country, those. Um, doesn't have high, high, um, high education for all people, like like uh, developed countries in Japan and America. There are tons of people still ha doesn't have enough media literacy to judge truth and judge facts. And I think that's because um, most of people 
don't have enough background knowledge and like for example historical knowledge, historical um, knowledge. So that's why I think so. The solution for this is um, the most prioritized things to for people to learn is I think his, history of the world and, and the country. Background yes. information. Yes. Understanding. Yes. And also they have to develop the capacity to read long sentences. Yes, like that is. Now that nowadays people yeah. read only very short sentences. Although they are more information. That's right. That's right. So it's a big challenge. Yes. I hope uh, you will spend a great time in George Washington University and uh, uh, look around the United States mm -hmm. and make friends mm -hmm. and uh, enrich yourself. Thank you. So, good luck. Thank you very much.